All right, what to do, players and trainers? Oh, my camera froze. All right, but I have Preston waiting long enough. And did everything freeze? Is my controller not working? All right, perfect. All right, so. I don't know why my Logitech isn't working. Oh, it turned off. Um, I am making horrible content here. All right, we're back. And let's go pick up a team. Let's pick a team because Preston's been waiting. And this week we have the Eject Button, Sandstorming, Choice Banded, um, Extra Drill. We have a Choice Scarf. U-turning, Braviari, a specially defensive Necrozma, a specially defensive Frostmoth, and then last but not least, a physically defensive Dracovich. Why? I feel like this is probably the best team. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. It's been a long week, honestly. It's just been a very, very long week. Um, it's just to let the game begin. Let the game begin. We're up against Preston. Very, 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 very good opponent. Oh, the last time we played, we won by timer, barely. He brings the almost no. Man, I almost brought Charizard, Charizard to take advantage of the sun, and I'm glad I'm not. Kind of upset. I'm not bringing Mold Breaker, but I do see Liberty to click Iron Head. I do see Liberty to click Iron Head. I kind of want to lead off with this already. Okay, okay. This is an interesting matchup for me, honestly. I don't see going wrong with Frostmoth, though. But there's no bad pick for me leading off with Extra Joe either. The only problem. Kind of. Let's do the Crosmo. Dude, he didn't bring Tyranitar. He hasn't picked his team yet. It's always Dracovish. Because if he leaves Hel Heliolisk. No, I'd rather keep it healthy though. Yeah, the Crosmo. The Crosmo will be it. Alright, so, depending on what my opponent, I do expect him to leave Helio, Heliolisk and expect it to be Scarf in a way. Um, if I get rid of the Ferrothorn, I, I click Iron Head with Choice Banded. Um, just Choice Banded Extra Drill. Extra Drill, Choice Banded, I think it does really, really good damage. Almost brought no Mold Breaker. Kind of wish I did. He actually leads with the Ferrothorn. Actually leads with the Ferrothorn. Which is okay with me. Like, if he wants to T-Wave me here, I'm okay with that. This is the one mod we want gone. This is the one mod we want gone. I'm just gonna heatwave. wave Let's play this fast-paced. He knows I can have heat wave. What does he have to switch into heat wave? He doesn't have the Tyranitar, so he really doesn't have much. We're gonna connect the heat wave. It's gonna do probably 50%. That is that, that is damage I want to see. No burn. He does get the Leech Seed off. Leech Seed off is fine with me. Okay, seeing that damage. So he's leftovers. <sighs> wow. That is a lot of HP. Extra Joe, I think, is a safe switch in, honestly. Well, I don't think Extra Joe is a safe switch in, but I think it's a good. Uh, if he. Can he? Would he protect? He doubles, he doubles, we, we get the double. But into whom? Pre Marina. Ooh. I'm gonna risk the brisket. I'm gonna risk it. 
I'm gonna risk the biscuit. I'm gonna risk the biscuit. Frost Moss is a switch in here, but if you choice Scarf, it's game over. But I'm gonna risk it. Uh, he pulled the double. Like, it's no way that... <sighs> We're choice banded, adamant. Picking up the kill. Extra Joe did it. Extra Joe did it. Extra Joe did it. Extra Joe did it. He knows I'm banded. Extra Joe did it, but he knows I'm banded. Extra Joe did it. Extra Joe did it. No way. Holy mackerel. Let's run the calcs. Run the calcs. What in the world, Extra Joe? What in the world? Dude. Oh my goodness gracious. I was going to risk that biscuit. Yo, this is... I've only won one finals by risking the biscuit. But man, he could have 100% been scarfed there. And I would have lost my win con here. Okay, okay, okay. So he brings this thing in. Uh, do I have Defog? I have Tailwind. I have Dragovish. I can take advantage here. I can try to thingy here. Uh, what do I want to do? He can't really touch me if I go Frostmoth, I believe. I believe him. Frostmoth is in a very good position because Primarina is gone and he does not have Torkoal like he did last time. Okay, so Excadrill, Primarina. The damage. He has reflect. I like it. I like it a lot. Cool. Cool, cool. I think I bug buzz though. Okay, so this is probably dual screenings. Dual screens, dual screens, dual screens. We do have break break on the Necrozma. There's the light screen. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. He's faster too. But he does have the natural speed. So what do we do here? Do we Tailwind? Do we Ice? I'm gonna U-turn. Gonna U-turn. See if uh, he sw hard swaps out. If he hard swaps out, good for me. If he doesn't, then... He does. He does. He does. He does. He goes into the mirror. Do we activate a weakness policy? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. <sighs> kind of want to trick room and brick break. I want a whirlwind. We will tr we'll, we'll trick room. We'll trick. I don't think he can knock me out with anything, unless he has probably shadow ball. So I am gonna trick room here. He probably has substitute actually. Oof. That's not bueno. Not bueno whatsoever. I do need to find out. No, no, he has to be physically defensive if he's gonna bring this thing, right? I have psychic fangs. I had psychic psychic fangs as well. Okay, so dual screening is gonna be a problem. Honestly, it will be a problem. So this is the Mew set. This is what we needed to know what set this thing is. I wish I had defog. Would have been very beneficial. He has bug buzz. I'm especially defensive though. Perfect, 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 perfect. Well, that was a crit too, man. You gotta crit me. Do you have to crit me? All right, so we're gonna trick room here. Wait, that was with a crit. We're gonna break break here. That was with the crit, honestly. Do you, do you, with the crit? All right, so we'll break these screens. I don't really care about the damage. Does he roost? Do you have roost? Now he bug buzzes again. Knocks me out. That's fine. That's fine. Earthquake is not enough. Shoot. But his fish is ran enough? Not banded. I 
Vicious Rent kind of seems like enough. Vicious Rent kind of seems like enough. Kind of. We'll find out now. Because I think he is um offensive. We just cook. I wish I would have substituted. If he goes into Fairy Throne, I will substitute. But I'm just going to click Vicious Rent here. He doesn't know if I'm banded or not. It's like very, very tricky. Because like if I'm banded, he loses this thing 100%. He has Heliolisk. He's gonna stay in. We're gonna click the Fish's Ren. Picking up the kill, Dracovish. Dracovish picking up the kill, baby. So the Trick Room, Break Break, um, Trick Room and Break Break worked out. Did I need to Krozma? Looking at the rest of his team, I do not actually. I hope Ferrothorn comes in here though, so I can substitute in its face and just click a Super Fang next turn. I don't wanna say this game is over though. I 100% don't wanna say this game is over, over. As we will, he's slower than me. <sighs> he's slower than me. What's we'll Super Fang? What's we'll Super Fang? What's we'll Super Fang? As he stuff rocks. Perfect. 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 That's good. That's good. I'll take that. I'll take that any day. We're gonna miss. Oh, we're gonna connect. We're gonna connect. Is the? It's a gun. Come on, please be gone. 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 I don't know if I kill from here. I don't think I do. Alright, so he's gonna see my lefties. We're actually running the clock with these lefties. That's okay with me. Please go on. No, Trigger is still not gone. He's gonna. He's gonna lead seed. And I'll get my own rocks up. Or I'll body press. So we'll switch out Dracovish. I did lose my momentum, but I do have a Tailwind user. I have a Tailwind user. He does have Pre-Marina. Actually, so here's the lead seed. It's gonna connect it. It's kind of, it's an issue though. Oof, healthy thing is not good. I kind of want to switch back out. He's actually very healthy. I kind of want to body press. Uh, I'll get my own stuff rocks because I don't know what in his team benefit. What is his last one? Heliolisk. Uh, I don't remember the last one. I know it's Heliolisk. There's something else. We're missing. The Mew's gone. Like that's my biggest concern. Mew's gone. I'll get my own rocks up here, and then I will. If he brings in the Claydol, I'll just probably have Whirlwind. I don't have Defog. I do not have Defog. I'll get my own rocks up. Perfect. Could have body press, but that's okay. I probably. I think he'll body press. He'll knock off. Does that still activate my eject button? Ah, uh, he knocks it off. Actually. Ooh. No bueno. Alright, I think I can body press here and actually just try to get as much damage off and finally... Let me see. Because Gigalith... That's good damage, actually. That's telling me that he is... I'm probably gonna die next turn, but that's okay with me. I see he goes for another leech leaf. That's actually good for me. That's actually better for me. Because I think I kill him with the next one. I could kill him with the next one, but I don't think. I kinda wanna keep the thing around. Oh, he has Haxorus. Haxorus is the last one. Right, so I think. We'll do Braviary. We'll do Braviary. I don't see what else I need Braviary for. I wonder if he'll... Mm, I'll get the Braviary. Come on, knock off, do something. He doubles out as I... Clay it off. Perfect. Player freak. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, Clay it off versus Braviary. I kind of have to, like... 
Brave Bird here, and hope he kills. Yeah, I have to Brave Bird, I hope he kills. I have to Brave Bird, and hope he kills. It doesn't. It does not. As he gets up the Reflect. I'm gonna go Dracovish. I'm gonna Dracovish substitute and then Psychic Fangs. Honestly, guys, uh, these these screens are very, very, very annoying. I'm not gonna lie. But as long as I can get Dracovish behind a sub and then click Psychic Fangs, I will feel 100% safe. He teleported. He actually teleported. Wow, what a play. That is a play and a half. <laughs> if you ask me, that's a play and a half. That's really a play and a half. Mm, he knows I'm not scarfed. I do have the Psychic Fangs, which I'm trying to really get off. I, I don't know how we're far we're, how far along in timer we are. I'm defensive, so I'm not sure if I can even live a hit. So I don't think he... He's probably like... He was into Ferrothorn. He messed up. He messed up. He can't break my sub. It's game over. He should have gone into Haxorus. Haxorus was the play here. I honestly believe Haxorus was the play here. He can't... We've seen knockoffs, Stealth Rocks, Leech Seed... He can't touch me. I don't think he can. This is where we reveal the tech. And Dracovish kind of wins this game. It's unfortunate that this can even go... It, it has the capabilities to go into a timer. Uh, I, I, I have the Psychic Fangs. I'm probably... I don't even know if I'll click it this turn. He does knock off. I don't think it should break unless he has attack investment. It doesn't even break. That's game over. That is game over, ladies and gentlemen. Preston knows it too, I think. I'm just gonna click enough super frame as it connects. Iron Barbs is gonna attack, but whatever, he's gonna knock off. Um, it's. And the damage, I'd even gauge Gigalift's damage. It's a fair thorn. To win the game, I just need a substitute. Psychic Fangs next turn. That's legit. How do we win the game? Like even if you switch out into Haxorus, I can. If he D dances, he goes into Heliolisk, which is a good switch in, in my opinion. One hundred percent a good switch in. Uh, oh, he has Hyper Voice. Ooh, I like it. I like it. Okay, okay. He has Hyper Voice. He has Hyper Voice. My opponent here has Hyper Voice, which goes through these substitutes. There it is, baby. That is Specs. Wow. I want a Bug Buzz. What does that even do me good against? I'd rather let this thing go down though. I'd rather let Gigalift go down 
and then just start clicking iron heads. Perfect. The effect is gone. I kill from this range too, because these specs, the way he, the damage he was doing, even though I would really like to. This is, eh, this is the play. This is the right play, actually, but... Because he's too low for me not to be able to kill. Right? Whatever, if this doesn't kill, then this is, like, a very weak Braviary, if you ask me. Very weak. Actually, the play was going to extra Joe because he came and touched me. But I do want Breviary to go down. He specs. I mean, scarfed. Oh, wow. That makes it tougher. Wow, that's just strong, man. Helios is actually pretty strong. Okay, so that's fine. Um, Clay all still around, which is a problem. And I only have three turns of Sandstorm left. I think I just click. Ah, oh, we're gonna run to timer though. No, no, I ran the clock too much in the beginning. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I think we can actually finish this game. Except that I threw away my win con. So extra drill was the play. Oh, shoot. That's no bueno, guys. Oh, no. That's no bueno. That is no bueno whatsoever. Yeah, he's gonna go into the, the Ferrothorn. If I don't even think I don't think I kill from here. If I do, that would be crazy. That's actually good. That's actually really good. Oh, 60 minutes to the timer's end! No! Oh, so that means it comes down to this last play. And he has no mods for a sandstorm extra drill. Timer sucks. Timer officially sucks. Because me making the misplay of going into Braviary, and I, I misplayed. Braviary was my win con because it it forces his Haxorus not to D-dance. Because he knows I'm scarfed. I, I legit thought, you know, it, well at the same time, if, we, if I could spec to just calc the damage, I'd be okay. But since I can't calc damage, um, I, I, I thought 100% that, that had to be... Specs, because it's my, unless I'm not, I'm not ice scales, I misgend. I misgend. I stinking misgend. I lost to a misgen. I would have lost to a misgen. That's what happens when you play when with finals. Yeah, because he, he would have to sack Heliolisk. He would have to sack a lot of Mons. Yeah, I'll receive it. So, great game to my opponent, Preston. Um... Bro, I think maybe if I wasn't so rushed. Once again, um, just wow, bro. That Mew would have really. He did get that one drop, um, which actually benefited me in the end of the day because I was able to break, break, and just get. But I think we had really, really good tech. I think my tech of the Trick Room plus the Break, Break, the substitute for the Ferrothorn, the um, the Choice Banded Pre Marina uh, play that was just fantastic. That was just phenomenal, if you ask me. So with that said, players and trainers, we did it. We are LDL's first three-time champion. Wish we could have played it on land. It would have been more and more exciting. Um, I will get up that video against Beard and um, see if we can... 
Uh, so it wasn't really a good game because he's barely staying awake over there. And this was way better than I thought. Yeah, that's my fault. I really thought I was going to be here sooner. I'm running on three hours of sleep, so I will. Sorry, Preston. I really am. But with that said, players and trainers, you guys are amazing. Stay blazing. Squid out.